Hello everybody, I hope that you are all doing very well and welcome back to another cryptocurrency technical analysis where in today's video I'm going to be giving you the most important levels to be trading Bitcoin from right now and uh, yeah I'll review how I've been trading this and then going forwards what's happening right now and uh, I hope that you thoroughly enjoy this one. It's going to be packed with lots of educational help and also uh, yeah tips on how to trade this. So um, yeah hope that you enjoyed and let's, let's go straight into this. Um, so reviewing back first before I get into what's happening right here, let's review what's happened so far. Far. So obviously we know that we got rejected from this really critical monthly and golden pocket Fibonacci resistance. Just perfect technical analysis playing out at that point. That rejection, okay. From there we form a nice ABC kind of pattern right down to the bottom of this old parallel channel that we were trading. Um, you know this was literally like three days ago. Now we were inside of this trading it really nicely, and obviously we broke up, come to monthly, and caught came right back to the bottom of that parallel, okay. And the confluence that we had with FIB extensions was perfect, really. We literally had the perfect, you know, confluence there with the 1272 FIB extension, okay? Um, so, like a nice mixture of confluences. We obviously had the bottom of our old parallel channel, okay? We had horizontal support and we had the 1272 coming together there. Um, to give you a nice uh, reason to look for a bounce, okay? So very nice bounce that we obviously saw there. And that led us into this second parallel channel, which is obviously an upward sloping one, um, moving up, okay? And, and and this is where we're looking for resistances, okay? You can see that the sell-off here was really quick and really fast, okay? So when you sell off really quickly, the bounces uh, can also be very fast and swift, okay? And you see, where do we come up to here? Right at the top of this sell-off, okay? And this would have been the target between uh, basically either 11, uh, basically 12,000, and you can see the top there, uh, 12,085, and you're looking at the bottom, 11,952. This was the, the target zone for this move up here, okay? And that's just really simply as well, again, bringing Fibonacci into this, the 0 0.5 Fib level. Okay, so from high down to low, you can see that's exactly where your, your 0 0.5 Fib is, okay, uh, right on, a, on onto that horizontal resistance as well. So a nice confluence to be looking for targets at that point, uh, buying at the bottom of, simply the bottom of that parallel, which offered a nice confluence of support. Um, so yeah, so far so good. And then you can now see we are moving up nicely within this parallel channel, uh, upward sloping parallel channel. Okay, so you have to now think, if you are looking at this as an ABC and we're going to come up for another 335 flat, well, that's uh, bring you up back up to 13K. But if you're looking at this as more of a zigzag and you go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, ABC, and then obviously you're looking for another five legs down. Apologies if you do not understand too much Elliott Waves. I know that we've got a lot of newer traders here as well. Uh, so I'll make it as simple as possible. I'll give you like both all scenarios that you can be looking for uh, over the coming days, weeks. Okay. So obviously taking a game for fibs from high to low. Okay. For if you are looking into interested in short entries, you obviously want to fill shorts as high as possible. So you're looking for up targets between the 618 to the 786. And you can also see that there's a high congestion around here, um, which you would imagine would would at least get a, a bounce um, before you, you know, it's unlikely you just go straight through this. Okay. So this is like where you could carry on in a nice upward trajectory like this, uh, but run into resistance at these levels. Okay. And on the flip side, if you are looking at this bearishly at this point, okay, you can simply go a fib extension now taken like this, and you can be looking down towards lower levels. Really, that 10,000 is a critical support. And we'll come over here where I've got the levels lined out. So, you know, this 10,300 10, uh, really down to 9.8 to 9.2. So they, those are the critical support levels that you can see here and really on the chart you're looking at that as i just mentioned that critical resistance is uh really at the 618 to the 786 okay and then what you're forming around here is is just like a minor intraday day trading okay so what i, what I would say is if, if you are now sat on the sidelines in tether for example usd you don't need to rush into a trade right now. You really don't need to rush into the trade. It's beautiful, uh, beautiful day that we have. You can enjoy the weekend and, and come back on Monday and make a more of an informed decision. You know, have we managed to actually break through the 618? Have we closed through the 786, for example? Or are we still finding resistance at 12K and we're actually breaking down from this channel uh, and obviously coming, you know, further down here to find support? So you can you can give this time. You can give this a few days and, and see how it plays out. There's no need really to rush into a trade right now. Uh, that's just a tip I would give you all. Um, and, you know, this 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 parallel has, has honestly been perfect. You can just see how we were, obviously, I was covering this on YouTube a few days ago. We obviously had that upward sloping higher lows going into consolidation under resistance, breaking through, back testing that. And then you see that perfect move up. OK, really, really, really perfect. This was really nice up to that monthly resistance. And you can see when we've came back down here. OK, we've come back, we've hit the midpoint, bounced right a bounce off of the bottom okay literally bounced off the bottom and this is what i was posting in my group uh this was a, a very good buy-in 
okay and um yeah I'll, I'll show you like some of the comments because this obviously for me now i love to help other people i love to help them and to see them making money and succeeding is just i love it i really really love it like my biggest joy in life is trading that's my passion and now like helping others and seeing them succeed that just like equals the same passion i absolutely love it and so it's really nice to see people buying the nailing the bottom here was literally 30 10,300. we got people nailing buy-ins with a 13,028 buy-in literally the best buying that you could get at this point you are now uh, literally from that buy about 16% uh, up in a day that's crazy kind of gains uh, we've we've got d2 here making 10,400 entries 230% gains um you know just really 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 amazing um you know seeing people succeed seeing people learn from me and i just love it it's it's really really good so uh yeah shout out to these traders over here who are you know putting in the effort and uh reaping the rewards really reaping those rewards and that was simply because of we obviously had this buy-in okay i'm going to show you the confluence extra confluence okay so as i've already shown you we obviously had our fib extension at this point we had our fib extension at this point okay of the 1272 we had the bottom of the parallel and over on the futures contracts if you trade futures you can see the support that was offered by the top of this futures gap okay so here was our futures gap first gap filled bounce filled fully okay here you have the gap and that gap it actually acts as support gaps should act as support if you're bullish okay you obviously fill this gap this second gap perfect 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 support you can see you do not fill this at all and you get a very strong bounce so there was even more confluence at this point to look for a bounce basically so um yeah not to uh you know go on about you know we d we done it but uh yeah just th those were the reasons why we were looking there basically okay so uh now you've understood that that now going forwards you can see here again just bringing your attention to this bottom of the parallel bounce top of the parallel and if we come down here you can just see bottom moving out slight deviation coming down midpoint touch midpoint touch moving up top of the channel support moving up to that obviously key resistance at this point and now you are again forming some higher lows at this point so this is nice okay and then one more time i will just really really em emphasize the levels that you're looking at here obviously you've got the 618 above 786 obviously the key resistance you've still got now at 12,100. um and yeah, not too many levels here. And on, on the flip side, on those support levels that you're obviously looking at, uh, really down at 11,500 here, down to 10,300, down to 9298. 98 is a key level, 10,000 psychological. Um, so I hope that you have thoroughly enjoyed this video. Um, I don't want to spend too much of your time. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to give you the real key levels to be trading from. I hope that this has honestly really helped you out. If it has, I honestly would appreciate a, a, a share or a like. Um, you know really really appreciate those sort of things um and it's free so it's even nicer for you so um yeah hope that you've enjoyed this if it has uh drop me a comment down below of um yeah yesterday i was obviously inquiring or uh pondering uh how people are trading this and the majority were looking bullish still so that's quite interesting i like to get a census of how people are trading this and now today i post the question of which altcoins are you looking at today obviously komodo with the biggest bounces here this is a very very big bounce on komodo uh <laughs> so that's pretty insane but uh, yeah I, I wonder what is uh you know what are you what altcoin are you most interested in right now okay uh very interested to see this or are you staying out of alts are you zero 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 alt trading right now and only focused on bitcoin um so are you looking to trade an alt right now or are you just in for the bitcoin um interested to know uh so yeah please give me a comment down below of what alt you're looking to trade or if you're not <laughs> so yeah hope you enjoyed this video have a brilliant weekend enjoy the sun and uh yeah just stay safe cheers everybody thank you